Lubaba TV. Welcome, our fan at Lubaba TV, and today is another beautiful day that God had granted to us. And I'm here with my three brothers, and we make some stories, and we need to know some few things concerning them and why they're here in Tanzania. So let us go together, and don't forget to subscribe, but also hit the bell so as to be updated with everything that we put in our channel. So welcome, brothers. Asante. Do you know welcome in Swahili? Anybody knows welcome in Swahili? Uh, Garibu. Yeah. So uh, you, you are now Tanzanian, right? <laughs> First of all, I would like you to introduce yourself, where you're here, where you're from, and stuff which you will little wish us to know. Oh, okay. Uh, yeah, my name is Shio, and I'm from Germany, Cologne, and yeah, that's me. Uh, yeah, I'm Antonius, I'm from Cologne too, Germany. Yeah. Uh, I'm Otto, I'm from Frankfurt, and yeah, I'm 19. Ah, okay. Nice, nice for people to know you. So, first thing I would also like to know, is it your first time to be in Tanzania, or you haven't been in Tanzania before? Uh, i never been to Africa, so no so Tanzania. This is your first time to be in Tanzania and in Africa? Yes, yes it is. Karibu <laughs> sana. Uh, yeah, for me the same. It's my first time in Africa. Uh, I was in Egypt once, but many Tanzanians say like Egypt is not really Africa as a, as a joke, you know. But yeah, uh, not really. It's my first time in Tanzania. Sure, sure, welcome. And uh, for me, it's my first time in Tanzania as well. I also it's the first time. So, first thing I would like to know: Why are, why are you interested to come in Tanzania? Because there are so many countries in Africa, many beautiful countries in Africa. Why specifically choose to come in Tanzania? Uh, we had the beers nice here. <laughs> so you came for the beers specifically. <laughs> no. no. Um, so actually, Tony can tell the story because he kind of got us here. Uh, yeah, so we are volunteers at a school, uh, Katempris in Kayanga, Karagwe, and uh, a friend of ours uh, recommended it to us, so yes. Uh, so you came here specifically to volunteer? For So you are teaching? Yeah, yeah. yeah we are uh, at an English school in Karagwe, uh, Kayanga, and yeah, we teach like uh, English, IT, German. Uh, but yeah, they had exams in the last week, uh, and because of that, we do not really uh, teach uh, totem st uh, stuff. But yeah, in the next week, we, uh, we will be teaching. Yes. Ah, so next week after here, then we will go back to teach. Yeah. yeah. Ah, okay. Nice to hear that. And so far, how long have you been in Tanzania? Three weeks, I think, or two and a half. Ah, two and a half. And how? What's your plan? You want to stay more, or you want to? How long do you plan to stay? Um, so I'm staying till Christmas and they're staying till Sylvester, uh, uh, to New Year. Ah, uh, to New Year and we stay till Christmas. Okay, you, I think you will really enjoy Tanzania. And so far I would like to know, have you, how many places have you visited in Tanzania so far? Till from when you came in Tanzania? Uh, yeah, we uh, first were uh, at the border, Mutukula, and drove to straight to Kayanga, Karagwe. And uh, we were in Bukoba last week, I think. And yeah, now we are in Mwanza, and yeah, I think that's like three places we were. And what's your plan to? Where do you plan to visit after here? Uh, after here, of course, back to school. But I think in December, when our school time is over, when the kids have holidays, I think uh, we want to visit uh, Zirengeti National Park, and yeah. I, I think we don't have fans yet. Ah. So, you one of the plans that you want to visit Serengeti. Uh, why you choose to be Serengeti? Because there are a lot of attractions, but why specifically you choose to come in? I mean, to, do you want to go to Serengeti? Um, because of the Ngoro Goro crater. <laughs> I don't know the word in English. Ngoro Goro. Goro. Yes, and uh, of course, we want to go to Zanzibar as well. But um, we have to wait till the 5th of December because then like we can start a tour because till then we have school. Ah, so, teach. Yes. Ah, so you have to go back, right? And you have been in Tanzania so long. What do you like most about Tanzania? When a person has to ask, ah, you have been in Tanzania, what do you like more about Tanzania? 
uh, for me it's uh, the nature <laughs> yeah the food too but uh, me personally and I think the other two don't like Ugali so much uh, but uh, other than that the food is great uh, I like uh, the food very much and yeah it's it's great here and you brother what do you like so far about Tanzania <laughs> um, I like the nature very much and of course the people the, they are always uh, very nice to us and um, yeah, she uh, just mentioned the food, of course, the food. <laughs> um, and yeah, I think that's my favorite. And you, what so far? I like people are very relaxed here. Uh, unlike in Germany, like there are a lot of people who are just kind of like stuck up. But yeah, and I like uh, I like the nature, of course. It's very exciting for us. And yes. I think it's and what do you, don't you like about Tanzania? What, what we don't like? Yes. Um, yeah, maybe uh, I don't know. I I don't think I can say like one word I don't like. Uh, uh, okay. Is there anything that you don't like? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> um, so we staying at the school, uh, like we said, um, and there we ate porridge. Mm, mm, mm. We don't like porridge, <laughs> and uh, I think yeah, ugali. Ugalis, no. Um, and yes, I think that's the only two things I can think of. And mosquitoes, uh, mosquitoes, uh, yeah, yeah. Mosquitoes, yeah, mosquitoes, yeah. So they are not they are no, in Europe. There are no mosquitoes. Uh, yeah, there are, but here, like uh, with malaria and stuff, you are like very uh, paranoid, and yeah. <laughs> so that's not a good thing. But uh, yeah. Uh, so. You said they are mosquitoes, but they, are, they don't, I mean, spread. Yeah, yeah. Uh, you, you just, like, have a mosquito bite and it's not, nothing happens. Like That's interesting to know. <laughs> and what do you like? Uh, I can think of a lot of things. So, first, of course, <laughs> Ugali, Muchoke and porridge. But just in the school, I think if you try the different restaurants, maybe it's good. Yeah, yes? yes. But at our school, it's, like, made for merry pupils. Mm -hmm. And uh, yes, I miss European food, and uh, I think that's it. Uh, and so f no, also 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 the cigarettes in Tanzania they don't taste good. Ah, so you didn't like the cigarettes in Tanzania? No. <laughs> ah, what is the what is the difference? Yeah. We, uh, they like this no, they like this Winston cigarettes yeah. here. Yes, yes. I don't know. I don't know, I don't know, I don't know why we discussed it, but um, I don't know if the same tabac as in Europe. Uh, uh, I'm not sure, but just I, I don't really like them. Have you tried the embassy? Embassy, uh, okay. Embassy is okay. It's okay. Yes. So it depends. Also it's with. Like yes, it depends with the. You know, it's <laughs> like. I, I think it depends with the quality. Embassy is so quality. Ah, you have it. <laughs> so you really like it. Yeah. Yeah. Embassy is nice. And something I would like to know. Do you know any Swahili word? Uh, yeah, like uh, Habari, like hello, right? Mambu, also hello, uh, Karibu, welcome, uh, Asante, thank you. And uh, Otto uh, teach me like uh, Wewe ni nani, Gina mm, Lango uh, Nishio. Yes, yes. And yeah, but that's it, I think. Uh, uh, yeah, nothing more. And you do know any Sayuri? Uh, I just know Asante. Uh, only Asante. <laughs> Uh, and how about the football? Do you like football? Yes. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> have you get the chance to see maybe Tanzanian football or you have in Simba and Yanga? Simba yeah. and Yanga. Yeah. yeah. So are you Simba you, or Yanga? <laughs> do you like it? We are, we, we are Simba. We are Simba. Both of you? Straight take the Simba. Yeah, why yeah. Simba? <laughs> I want to know why Simba. Because you bought a jersey. Yeah, the, yeah, first off, the uh, jersey looks nicer than Yanga's. Mm. And yeah, I think Yanga uh, always wins, right? Uh, Sometimes they. It depends. Yeah. It depends. Yeah. Depends. Yeah. Because we are not for the. Uh, and you say it. You like Simba, right? Yeah. Both of you. Yeah. Mm, and you say it. What? Why? Why Simba not younger? Uh, yeah. Because first off, the the jersey looks nicer than youngers, you know. And yeah, uh, I think younger is uh, like more winning than Simba, and because of that, yeah, we must stay with Simba, and <laughs> uh, hopefully they win the league. Yeah. So you think this league? Simba will yeah, I will give you the information. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and you? Why do you think Simba is best than Yanga? Uh, I, uh, I bought a Simba uh, jersey so I have to. Ah. <laughs> and you? 
Uh, for me it's tricky because all the pupils at school ask you Simba or Yanga and if you say Simba then the one half is gonna hate you if you say Yanga the other one is gonna hate you so it's difficult so it was like ah, to be Simba I don't know yet but I think I will go with Simba as well um, when you come in Tanzania, yeah. uh, you you face a lot of challenges, right? Yeah. Uh, sometimes you face a lot of challenges and sometimes good things. So maybe I would like to know the challenge that you have faced in Tanzania, and you said, ah, this is the challenge. Maybe it should be uh, maybe in in traveling or maybe in living. Did you face any challenge? A challenge? Um, yes. Uh, for us, it's really complicated, like to go from one place to another. Because um, from Bukoba to Manda it's easy because there's a ferry, but you always have to look with the buses and there's no really a website for the bus, yes. so you have to like ask around. And the challenge, of course, is also the food. Ah, okay, the food also is different, right? Yeah, because of how you say Durchfall. <laughs> I don't know. And, and do you have any challenge? Uh, uh, yeah. Um, Maybe the public schools, you know, uh, yes, yes. because we are at a private school and they have like books and computers and stuff. And uh, yeah, but uh, we were told that the public schools like don't have anything uh, like books or something. And yeah, would uh, put more money into public schools and try to change them. Okay. And you do see the challenge? Um, I think the challenge uh, we got uh, tra with traveling is um, because we are not Tanzanian people, we have to, uh, you know, visa, visa, and uh, at the border it was, uh, it took long. It, yeah, it's uh, tough. As not not tough, but it's, it's difficult. Yeah, yeah, difficult. Yeah. And what was your best moment in Tanzania? I said, yeah, wow, when I remember this time, ah, it was, I had, they really had the good uh, time. What's your best experience now? I mean, the, your best moment in Tanzania? I think when we finally got the Piki Piki to work. Mm -hmm. So we had like an old Piki Piki from the um, head of school and we repaired it and we got it to work and I like, trained a little bit it was fun of course but like also the sunset here right. yeah that's great yeah <laughs> which people you see i will show them at least they should see the, how the sunset looks like here yes and also at Pukoba when we went to a club mm. and we went on the roof to like get a cigarette mm. I just smoke one and then we just like looked around and it exactly looked like Paris. That was an incredible moment. Uh, it was Tinny was all, all the time was like, oh, this is fucking Paris. <laughs> <laughs> and you? Uh, yeah. I think the sunset here must be one of the top moments. Uh, but the graduation at the school uh, we were was like crazy because we just arrived the day before and then we go to the graduation, you know, and it, it, yeah, it's like seven hours people singing and doing uh, dancing and stuff. That's very great. Ah, and you do? Uh, I don't think I have a favorite moment, but I, uh, uh, I very like the view here, mm. the view and the evenings here on the rooftop. It's very beautiful. Welcome. You have to. You have to. I would also like you to say anything that you wish to say, maybe for the viewers or for your fellow travelers or for any. But that you want, you wish anything to say. Uh, I would say, believe in yourself, and all your dreams come true. Yeah. <laughs> believe in yourself, and everything come true. And maybe do some workouts so you can look like Shio without a shirt on. <laughs> yeah. yeah, subscribe to his channel. Come to the ho uh, hotel, hostel. Yes, you um, <laughs> thank yeah. you, thank you. <laughs> yeah. So thank you for your time, brothers. For sure, I really enjoyed. We have been together for I think three to four days, something like that. I really enjoyed. We had a good experience, and I really welcome you. Just feel at home when you are in Tanzania. When you are in Mwanda next time, don't just to call. Hey, yeah. I'm here. So, we, welcome we very much. Again. Yeah, we'll be back in like two or three months. Uh, so, Karibuni uh, San. <laughs> yeah, Santa. So, thank you for your time. And don't forget to subscribe and hit the bell so to be updated and see everything that we put here. Any, any German word? Walla, der Burger hat nicht geschmeckt. <lacht> Dankeschön, dass wir hier dabei sein durften. Äh, vielen Dank. <lacht>